Family comes. Family comes. Welcome to the round 16 of the 2024 Interschools Reading Quiz. This quiz is aimed at igniting a vibrant culture of reading among brilliant minds. This is the first round of 16 contests, and it features four schools. Sterling Heights Academy. <laughs> Ave Maria School. Sub School, <laughs> and finally, Dansuman Cluster B Schools. <laughs> now let's get to know our Cubs. Sterling Heights Academy is represented by Caleb Ousuche, Michael Opokumani, Jerem Eli Pechi Mano. Congratulations on making it this far. Anybody you want to acknowledge on this journey? Yes. My mother and father. <laughs> Ave Maria School is represented by Isilina Dazi. Solomon Amejo. Yes, Michelle Yadom. <laughs> Sub School is represented by Cyrus Kote Williams. Jacinta, I hear you are the youngest contestant we have on stage today. Yes. Are we seeing you in Canada? Yes. Oh, congratulations. Also, yes, Finally, Dansoman Cluster B is represented by Lawrence Ando, Manuela Mauli Botwe, by Bachuri. How has your preparation been like? Please, it has been very elating. It was very nice. Well and done. Before we begin this round, let's acknowledge our sponsors. The 2024 Interschool Reading Quiz is, sponsored, is produced by Perby Cubs in partnership with UNESCO Accra World Book Capital and sponsored by the Mohinani Group, Brands KFC and Polytank, Ecobank Ghana, and our media partner, Joy Prime. My name is Amelia Bewa, author by day and lover of all things reading. I will be your quiz mistress for the day. <laughs> the rules before we start. Before we begin, here are the rules of the game. There will be three rounds of questions. The first round consists of 16 multiple questions. The second round of questions will consist of eight true or false questions and eight riddles. The final round will be a problem-solving exercise. In the first and second rounds, each school will answer four questions. For each question correctly answered, you gain three points. There will be no bonus question. Round one. Let's begin with Sterling Heights. The wingspan of eagles can be up to dash feet long. Yes. Please, the answer is eight feet. The correct answer is eight. <laughs> Ave Maria, your question is, dash are the most common ecosystems? Yes. D, oceans. The correct answer is oceans. <laughs> Sub school, your question is, the eagle's eyesight is dash times better than a human's. Yes, Timothy. Five. The correct answer is five. <laughs> the East China Sea and the South China Sea lie along China's dash coast. 
Please, the answer is Southeasting. Southeasting. <laughs> Sterling Heights. Dash countries share a border with China. Yes, Michael. Auntie, please, there are 14 countries bordering China. The correct answer is 14. <laughs> the Spinosaurus was named by A. Ernst Stroma, B. George Windsor, C. Chris Beth, D. Sandro Metz. Yes, Nisilina. And it's Stroma. Yes. <laughs> Saps, your question is, a giant panda eats more than dash of bamboo in one day. Yes, Jacinta. C, 40 pounds. The correct answer is 40 pounds. Dancerman Cluster B, your question is, Ireland earned the nickname the Dash due to the green color of its lowlands. The correct answer is Emerald Isle. You are correct. <laughs> Sterling Heights, your question is, Herling, it's a dash that is a thousand years old. Yes, Jeremy. Gaelic sport. Gaelic sport. The correct answer is Gaelic sports. Well done. Ave Maria. Your question is: Aztec spears had tips made from dash. Yes, Nisilina. B, a stone called obsidian. A stone called obsidian. <laughs> Sub school, your question is, a group called the Dash lived near Stonehenge. Yes, Timothy. A, Druids. Druids. Dancerman class, the B schools. Your question is, Stonehenge was most likely part of a? Burial site. Burial site. Burial site. <laughs> the schools are neck to neck here. Sterling Heights, your question. At Stonehenge, a, a dark path leads to a dash. Yes. C, a nearby river. The correct answer is a nearby river. <laughs> Ave Maria School, your question is, the Eskimo role is how kayakers dash. Yes, Nisilina. A, get back up after they fall inside the water. The correct answer is... <laughs> Sub school. Your question is, kayaks that have dash are steadier in, in the water than other kayak types. Yes, Jacinta. A, flat bottoms. The correct answer is flat bottoms. <laughs> well done. Dancer one, Cluster B. Your question is, white water kayaks are designed to dash. Please, the answer is turn around rocks. So easier. Turn around works easier. The correct answer is 
turn around rocks more easily. That brings us to the end of round one. Here are the results for round one. Sterling Heights, round one, 12 points. <laughs> Ave Maria School, 12 points. <laughs> Sub School, 12 points. <laughs> and Dansoman Cluster B Schools, 12 points. Congratulations to our wonderful cups and more grease to your elbows. To my lovely cups, the second round of the quiz, there will be 16 questions. Eight questions will be answered with either true or false. The remaining eight questions will be engaging riddles based on the books you have read. Each correct answer is, will be awarded three points. Best of luck to all competing schools. Sterling Heights. Your question is, eagles hunt with humans in parts of Africa, according to the book, Eagles, Birds of Prey, True or False? Yes, Caleb. B, false. False. <laughs> Kayakers use heat flippers to protect themselves in cold water. True or false? Grace Michelle. False. False. <laughs> Sub school. An Aztec warrior might rise in rank if he paid a large fee. True or false? Cyrus. False. The correct answer is false. Well done. Well done. Danceman Cluster B. Aztecs wore armor made with thick cotton. True or false? True. The correct answer is true. Sterling Heights, your question is, Bactrian camels have three humps, true or false? Auntie. Yes, Michael. This, the answer is false. False. <laughs> well done. Ave Maria, your question is, the Great Wall of China was built to honor an ancient empress daughter. True or false? Grace Michelle. False. The correct answer is false. Well done. Sub school. Your question is, the shamrock is a white-haired bear, bear, and a symbol of Ireland. True or false? Yes, Iris. False. The correct answer is false. <laughs> Danceman Cluster B, your question is, Ireland and Northern Ireland are two countries on the same island. True or false? The answer is true. The answer is true. <laughs> Sterling Heights, your question is, wouldn't it be easier to climb if you tie the pot to your back instead? Who is speaking here according to the book titled Anansi and the Wisdom Pot? <laughs> yes.
Yes, Jeremy. His Anna says young son. Anna says young son. Anna says young son. Young son. The answer is Anansi's son. Well done. Um, Ave Maria School, your question is, as an eagle, I fly at a top speed of up to 100 miles per hour. Who am I? Yes, Grace Michelle. The bald eagle. The correct answer is the bald eagle. <laughs> we were swords that were carried by skilled warriors among the Aztecs. What were we? Timothy. The Makwa Hill. The Makahit, yes, Makahital. Well done. <laughs> Danceman Cluster B, your question is After we arrived, many Aztecs died from European diseases. Who were we? Please, the answer is the Spaniards. The Spanish or the Spaniards. Is this <laughs> the correct answer is the Spanish. <laughs> Sterling Heights, your question is, I am sometimes referred to as the roof of the world. What am I? Yes, Caleb. The Tibet Plateau. The correct answer is the High Plateau of Tibet. Well done. <laughs> I am the favorite diet of panda bears in China's forests. What am I? Yes, Grace Michelle. Bamboo. Bamboo. The correct answer is bamboo. <laughs> Great job. Sub school. Your question is, I help keep kayaks straight in rough water. Who am I? Yes, Timothy. White water kayaks. Oh, wait, uh, uh, the flat bottom. The what? Flat bottom. The correct answer is radis. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Dance one cluster B. Your question is. I am a language that has been spoken in Ireland for about 2,000 years. Who am I? The Gaelic language. The Gaelic language, correct. <laughs> Are the results for the round two. Sub school, 21 points. <laughs> Sterling Heights Academy, 24 points. <laughs> Ave Maria School, 24 points. 
Danceman Cluster B schools, 24 points. Well done, ladies and gentlemen. Now, folks, welcome to the final round of the quiz, Dab the Genius Round. Let's make it count. This segment of the quiz is proudly brought to you by the Mohinani Group brands, KFC and Polytank. In the Genius Round, you'll be tasked with providing specific answers to a series of questions based on the books you have read. On your tables are question papers and answer sheets. The questions are, do you know this country? Identify the parts labeled A to F. Question two, indicates the following information relating to the country in question one. Capital city, official language, national holiday, natural resources, list four, unit of money. Your time begins now. with Sterling Heights for question one. Um, A, you gave Central China. I can't give it to you. Two, um, Beijing, you wrote Northeast China. I can't give it to you. Three, Yellow River. I can't give it to you. Eastern China, D, I can't give it to you. E, Southeastern China, I can't give it to you. F, South China, Southern China, I can't give it to you. So you get no points for this question. Capital city, Beijing, you got it correct. Official language, you got Mandarin correct. National holiday, you got October 1st correct. Natural resources, you got natural gas, correct. Oil, correct. Coal, correct. Copper, correct. Four points for that. And the unit of money, you got yuan, which is also correct. For this, for this question, it was eight points, and you got all eight correct. Well done, Sterling Heights. Ave Maria, A, you did not put anything down. B, you got Beijing correct for two points. Um, Yellow River, I can't give that to you for C. D, you did not write anything. E, you did not write anything. F, you, you put Yangtze River, which I cannot give to you. So you got two points out of this, out of this answer. Two out of 12. Ave Maria, for your second answer, you got Beijing correct for capital city. Official language, Mandarin, you got it correct. National holiday, October 1st, you got it correct. Natural resources, coal, you got it correct. Copper, you got it correct. Salt, you got it correct. Oil, you got it correct. Unit of money, yuan, you got it correct. Ave Maria, you got 10 points in this round. Sub school, A, China. Uh, you, you did not get that correct. B, Beijing, you got it correct. C, Bohai C, you got it correct. D, you wrote Yellow River. Unfortunately, I can't give that to you. Five, East China C, you got it correct. F, South China Sea, you got it correct.
capital city, Beijing, you got it correct. Official language, Mandarin, you got it correct. Um, national holiday, you did not get it correct. You canceled it. Natural resources, coal, copper, manganese, bauxite, you got it correct. Unit of money, you won, you got it correct. You got seven out of You got seven out of eight. You got 15 points in all in this round. <laughs> Danceman Cluster B schools, are you ready? China, you did not get it correct. Beijing, you got it correct, two points. Bohai C, you got it correct, two points. Um, D, you wrote England, I can't give it to you. E and F, you did not write anything. So you got four out of 12 here. Capital city, Beijing, you got it correct. Official language, Mandarin, you got it correct. October 1st, you got it correct. National resources, you got copper, zinc, bauxite, manganese, I can give you three out of four. Three out of four. And then you got the unit of money, you got the yuan. So in this, in this round, you got seven out of eight. 11 points in all. At the moment we've been waiting for, at the end of the round three, the final results are Sterling Heights Academy, 32 points. <laughs> Ave Maria School, 34 points. <laughs> Danceman Cluster B Schools, 35 points. Sub school, 36 points. <laughs> Congratulations, sub school, on a well played game. You have made it to the quarterfinals of the 2024 Inter-School Reading Quiz. Are you cool? Yeah. Also making it to the quarterfinals is Danceman Cluster B School. Yeah. Well done, Danceman Cluster B. Excellent job. I look forward to seeing you in the next stage of the competition. To Sterling Heights and Ave Maria, your journey in the inter-schools reading quiz has come to an end. This is where we draw the curtains on the first of four rounds of 16 contests. Tune in tomorrow to Joy Prime as we bring you the second of our four rounds of 16 contests featuring Theo Rose School, Najis Angels Educational Center, Prospect International School, and Independence Avenue Cluster of Schools. <laughs> the 2024 Inter-School Reading Quiz is, sponsor, is produced by Perby Cups in partnership with UNESCO Accra World Book Capital and sponsored by the Mohinani Group and their brands KFC and Polytank. Until the next contest, keep reading. Today a reader, tomorrow a leader. Goodbye.